Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a last minute design and it's a leprechaun buckle. This is such a cute design and it does not take that long to do. So if you're needing a last minute manicure for a St. Patrick's Day party today, you can do this one. Now let's get into it to see how it's done. Like we always do, we're gonna start off with a base coat to protect our natural nails. Now we're going to place down a sheer wash of pink and it's basically a my nail color but better type situation. Once our sheer wash of pink is dry we're going to go in with a green just on the tips. Now on top of the green tip I'm going to go in with an even darker sparklier green. Now it's time to make the leprechauns buckle. Now we're going to take a black, I'm going to be using a black nail art pen. You can use a striping blush and black polish, it does not matter. Don't worry if you get a little black on your skin, that will come off with some acetone. Now, the leprechaun buckle is for the ring finger and my thumb finger. I'll come back with the next step. And now to make the leprechaun's buckle. I'm just going to take some gold polish, just to drop right like that, and a detail sharpening brush. I'm going to go in, dip make two lines and then connect them on the top and bottom. Now to pull in all of our other fingers into this design I'm gonna take that same gold and same striping brush and I'm just going to outline the edging of all my other fingers that don't have the leprechaun buckle. Now the only thing left to do is to seal in our design with a quick dry top coat. And here's the final look. I hope you guys enjoy this and if you want recreate it for a fun St. Patrick's Day manicure at the last minute. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and share with your friends. Subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. And leave a comment down below for what you would like to see next. And I'll see y'all next time. Bye!